Hey, Namaste. This is Sacred Owl with another chapter of Real Talk by Sacred Owl. Today, I want to talk about yourself. That's right, yourself. You, yourself. Like myself, yourself. And the reason I want to talk about yourself because we're the key to everything happening in our lives. Everything, every reaction, every decision, anything that we've experienced in some way or some level, we have participated in that. We are co-creator of that energy. Well, if you have a challenge in your life that you are not 100% happy with yourself, then yourself will start to respond to that in a manner because it connects to the God source and it starts to respond to yourself in the manner that you feel about yourself. How can you get clarity if you're not happy with who you are? How can you get clarity if you don't even like who you are? How can you get clarity if you don't love yourself? And the reality is, is that loving ourselves and getting clarity is something that can be done every day, every morning, every evening. But you, you lack this thing called confidence. Confidence in who you are and what you are. You are a marvelous, amazing human being. Yes, I'm talking to everybody that's, talk, that's watching this video. You are a marvelous and amazing human being. You are still here. You're still thinking. You're still co-creating. You're still making things happen. So how is that not amazing? How is that not beautiful? How is that not a part of who you are? Yourself. You want to have a good relationship? You can't until you have a relationship with who? Yourself. Yourself. If you don't have a good relationship with yourself, you're going to attract the same type of relationship you have with yourself by somebody else who's going to do it to you vicariously. What is your truth? Well, that's up to you to decide. Are you going to let the past continue to hold you hostage or are you going to try to do your best to get deeper into what it is and be here in the moment like now i'll give you an example we all have experienced dogs and i hope everybody in a positive way well when you have a pet dog or an animal that like that that that's very loving and loyal they live in the moment that's right you can walk out the door and come back 10 minutes later and they act and respond to you as if they just haven't seen you for three weeks. Because they are in the moment. They are living in that moment. They are loving that moment because they are happy to see you. Are you like that every time you get up in the morning? If not, then we need to work on it. Listen, I'm not just pointing you out. I'm talking to myself also. I need to work every day to feel good about who I am and to be excited about what I am and to be excited about everything I do. Be like the dog who sees its owner, happy, wagging his tail, grateful to see you, joyful to see you, licking your face and hugging you the way it does. That's how we should treat ourselves. And if you start to do that, I promise you, I guarantee you, I make 100% sure that if you treat yourself that way, you will now attract people to respond to you in the same mannerism. You are an amazing being. And you have to love yourself, like yourself, and treat yourself with the same consciousness that you treat others and offer to that. If you are not approving yourself, then you will attract people who are not approving of you. If you want validation, start with you, and then everything else will follow accordingly. You are a creator. You are part of source. You are my brothers and sisters. I love you. Peace.